Welcome back everyone. Blumhouse's Five Nights at Freddy's film released back in October. And wow, did they release an amazing film. But after watching the film, I knew I had to build a few of the new characters from the film out of Lego. Sparky the dog is technically not a new character. He was an easter egg back in the first game in 2014. And now finally he's shown off in the film years later. In the film we never really see a full body version of the animatronic. But behind the scenes videos and pictures give us more info about what he could have looked like in his heyday. Also, in the diner scene with our friendly waiter, we see the sign of the diner, which is called Sparky's. So who knows, maybe the dog animatronic performed here once upon a time. I built Sparky out of mostly tan and dark tan parts. Making his black floppy ears, adding his golden bone collar, and making his eyebrows movable to change his expressions around. I hope we see more of Sparky in the future films and games. The one big new thing the film brings to the Freddy's universe that wasn't in any of the games was this weird torture Freddy device. We don't fully know who made it or where it came from, but it's implied William Afton built it at some time. The head is rusted with broken parts, with two red eyes, and of course, the saw blades. I tried putting in some details into the stand that holds it up. William Afton, played by the amazing Matthew Lillard, was probably one of the many reasons why I loved this film. He wears his iconic yellow bunny outfit in the ending of the film. It looks like it has some burn marks on it, which is very interesting. I think they did a great job bringing the suit to life, and I cannot wait to see it become withered and green and turn into Springtrap in the future movies. I knew building his head would be difficult since his eyes needed to be the right color. Plus, I don't have a ton of yellow parts in my collection. I made his iconic purple bow tie, and I made sure to add the burning marks. I also gave him his iconic knife. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any suggestions, drop a comment and I might build it in the future. Thank you so much for watching.